All right, we've got an interesting publishing announcement. Uh, the publisher First Second will be putting out Hayao Miyazaki's Shuna's Journey in a new English edition uh, this uh, November. Shuna's Journey is a manga that was originally published in 1983, filled with gorgeous watercolors by Hayao Miyazaki. And people refer to this as a proto uh, Nausicaa Valley of the Wind. Uh, I don't know anything about uh, First Second as a publisher. Yeah, so um, they don't publish manga. Um, they do publish graphic novels. Uh, they do a lot of like YA and middle grade type stuff. A lot of stuff for younger readers. Um, in, in, in which case, I think Shuna's Journey kind of fits in there. I think they also do the... Um, yeah, they do the Adventure Zone comic, I believe. Uh, adaptation of, of, the, of the podcast by the McElroys. Um, but yeah, no, I, I was surprised by this news because, uh, I didn't realize this was even something they were considering doing. I mean, they're not referring to this as a manga in their, when their announcement, they refer to it as a graphic novel, um, which it, it is. I mean, it is a graphic novel. It is also a manga. Um, but it's fascinating. I'm just kind of surprised that, uh, like Viz doesn't have it because they have, I think, all the other Miyazaki related stuff in English. I believe in the description it says it's um it's not really more like a manga because um well it's in color right yeah it's color all watercolor images and text is mostly presented as captions oh it's interesting ba it's based on a Tibetan folktale well I think I mean it's really cool I'm and I'm fascinated by the idea of a non manga graphic novel publisher branching out to doing you know licensed uh, work like this so. Uh, I'm really curious to see what it's going to look like. I like for a second. They, they publish some good stuff. Very nice. If we get a chance, we'll uh, think about taking a look at this too. But mm -hmm. my guess is this is print only. So um, not necessarily. I do think that for a second does do digital. Um, I mean, this says uh, right now it's scheduled for publication in a hardcover volume. That sounds expensive. <laughs> so we'll see. Not that expensive. Like I'm looking right now at um, another comic they publish, a history comic about the Stonewall riots. Um, the hardcover is 19.99, um, so it's it's not you know not cheap, but it's not too expensive, uh, all things considered. Yeah, we'll try to uh, take a look in the future.